choking your chest I can see it in your eyes that you're shaking Cause you're holding it back mm -hmm. Maybe you'll make up your mind Now I'm here by your side So let it all out of me Let it all out of me Oh, I will hold you in the dark Make it for Hello friends, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for clicking on today's video. As you can see in the title, I am decorating for Valentine's Day for 2023. And in today's video, I am going to decorate my bar cart. Um, I love displaying like candy and treats and just so much decor, like baking decor and just so much on my bar cart. I don't really use it for alcohol. There is some alcohol on it, um, like what we use for or vanilla extract and what we use sometimes on certain holidays but for the most part it is filled with my glass reusable cups that I like to fill up with coffee or drinks and then just like my decor so for the most part I use it for all of that but there is some alcohol on it but I call it a bar cart because that is just what it's called even though I don't use it for alcohol um <laughs> sorry that was a long detailed description of my bar cart but I love my bar cart. I always love decorating with it. It's one of my favorite places to decorate where I can get the most creative. And I am also going to do our dining table centerpiece. So I hope you enjoyed today's video. We are going to do a little sweet shop on my bar cart. And I think it turns out so cute. I got some new canisters from Target's bullseye section that were $5. So there are lots of cute canisters on my bar cart that I will be filling up with lots of Valentine's. Day candies. All out of me. Let it all out of me. Oh, I will hold you in the dark. Make it forget about what's wrong. Let it all out of me. Sometimes when I'm thinking. I also got that heart little sign um, from the bullseye section at Target. Target's Valentine's decor for Valentine's Day 2023 and spring decor for 2023 is so cute right now in the bullseye section. The hearth and hand and threshold sections have some really cute items as well, but the bullseye section is just hitting so good right now. Not safe and sound. What if I'm not candies that I ended up getting for the canisters for um, my bar cart are the traditional conversational hearts. I honestly love those. I'm a big fan of them. They are like the candy that I always look forward to around Valentine's Day. Um, and then I also got like chocolate Reese's hearts. Those are so delicious. Um, new candy that I got this year. They are like Jolly Rancher jelly hearts and there's like cherry watermelon and strawberry so delicious um and i also got m m's um and i think that is all of like the candy i got multiple bags of all the candy so there's definitely extra um each canister of like the small heart ones they took one bag of the jolly rancher jellies um and then the other heart canisters they took half a bag of the Reese's so I ended up getting to use one bag and just putting them in two of the heart canisters and then 
in that little coin guy with the heart on it I just put half the bag of M&Ms and then I used uh, four bags of conversational hearts one of them three bags went into like that big giant canister and then that other canister I only put one bag of those conversational hearts so it filled it all up and they look so good and those candies are so delicious I always love to use little crafts that my son painted or made or colored around with my decor. It makes it so much more special and I get to display his little art. Um, he is three years old, coming in a couple of weeks. Um, I cannot believe that. He turns three on February 4th. Um, so I just love to display his art. He's so good at painting and just so creative. So I love it so much. And then that sweet shop um, little guy I got from the Target Dollar Spot last year. And it came with like a pack of three wooden decor items and so I just used that one I also used it last year and then these X's and O's um, my son also painted I actually have a video that I just posted of him painting them so I definitely want to display them because they're so cute and perfect for Valentine's Day and he loves dinosaurs so the dinosaur ones really got his attention and he loved that so much um, and then I'm also going to stick in just some faux pics that I got from the Target dollar spot this year they had some lavender picks and then they also had these greenery picks and they were each just a dollar and they look so good on the bar cart I definitely love to include these with all of my decor until you set me free my eyes were closed now I see clear as day and I just wanted to say that you can take me high Feels like I can fly I don't need anybody, I don't need anybody else No one will ever take me, no one will ever take me away from you I promise I will hold on to you Next I am hanging up this Valentine's Day heart pom-pom garland. I always love to hang this up on my bar cart. It just adds so much more to the bar cart, makes it look a little bit more for Valentine's Day and just so sweet. Um, gives it more color and I got this I believe in 2021 at Michael's. It's so cute and I always love to use it. And then next I am going to put these rags on my bar cart. These are new in the bullseye section at Target this year for Valentine's Day for $5. And I love that white one with the red hearts. So cute and just perfect for Valentine's Day. And I love how minimal it is. So this is it for my bar cart, my Valentine's Day bar cart for 2023. I love it so much. I love all the color and just how everything turned out with all of the canisters with treats in them, the painted little crafts for my son, and that heart sign. I love the colors, but I also love how I use some greenery and neutrals. It's just so cute, so minimal, and I just love it so much for Valentine's Day. Please let me know how you feel about it. I I definitely feel like this year's bar cart looks so much better than last year's and I remember last year I loved it so much but I would love to hear from you guys after I get done showing you the bar cart we will move on to the dining table I, the two of us, we don't have to stop baby let's go for a ride you and I let us run over Now we 
layer onto the dining table first I need to clear it off there was so much like gardening stuff seeds my son's Valentine's Day basket yes I already have that prepped I've been getting little things along the way um, as they've been coming out for his Valentine's gift now I need to start working on his birthday present um, but I'm just clearing it off and then I'm going to wipe down the table with multi-surface cleaner because it was really gross filled with dust and dirt from all the gardening stuff Smile upon your face baby make your worries go away so put your trust in The dining table is all wiped off and cleared off I am going to lay down this Valentine's Day table runner I got this from Target in the threshold section last year um, or maybe 2021 I believe it was last year though um, I love it it's so cute it goes perfect with all of my decor and looks so good on this table it's just a great piece to like throw on the table and it just adds so much so I love using it next I am going to put this plank of wood down for like the base of the centerpiece on the dining table I am also going to add in these pink flowers I love to get these at Target again with the threshold section they are only five dollars each and they always have them like different seasons different holidays different looks and I just have so many of them because they're so affordable and just great little pieces to have for all year round decor I'm also going to add in a couple of candles and then these heart like these wooden hearts I actually got these this year at Hobby Lobby and I think they are so cute again very neutral and natural so I love that look for like the minimal decor um, and I'm also going to throw in a rose and I think that this centerpiece turned out so perfect I also had um, like a bottle like a mix milk bottle um that used to just be a glass milk bottle by itself but then um last summer i put in some lavender to dry it so now there's dried lavender in that milk bottle and i just put it behind the centerpiece and it goes so well because it's like pink and purple so i think it looks so good i love how the centerpiece turned out well, this is it for today's video. Thank you so much for being here and watching. I hope that you got some ideas or inspiration um, for decorating for Valentine's Day. I love how everything is so minimal and how everything turned out. I definitely love how this year's Valentine's Day just ended up and I cannot wait to share you more decorating ideas and inspiration throughout more videos as I finish decorating my house for Valentine's Day but again thank you so much for being here I hope that you enjoyed today's video please do not forget to like comment and subscribe definitely if you want to see more videos and more decorating inspiration but I will see you all again next time bye friends Work.